There we go. Hello, hello, hello to the YouTubes and things. We got the game in. It's playing this uh, fancy little intro here. I wasn't really paying attention. I was getting ready, but <laughs> I don't think it's anything important anyways. Um, human parachute. Thank you, Thank you man. Parachute for following. Oh, this is interesting. Why? Okay, yes, yeah, so I'll definitely turn on progressive scan. Yes, I do wish to play in progressive scan mode. Yes, keep setting. Awesome. Why is it so fuzzy? <laughs> that, I mean, I'm pretty sure it's meant to be that way. I don't think it's just like something weird, but it's also weird. Can we center the screen? Yes, screen placement. Because it needs to go over and down. There we go. That looks good enough, at least. Where am I? Oh. Return. New game. I've only ever... Actually, I don't think I've ever played any of Shadow of the Colossus before. I gonna say, I think I've only played a little bit of it before, but I'm pretty sure it was actually Eco. Because I had, like, Eco and Shadow of the Colossus collection on the PS3. And I played a bit of it on, uh, of Eco at least. But I don't remember if I ever even tried Shadow of the Colossus before. I've heard a lot about it, and I've seen some gameplay of it. I remember when I was a kid, uh, G4 talking about it all the time. But I never ended up giving it a shot myself. Horse does not want to go in here. Probably wouldn't want to go in somewhere where I'm gonna be like sealed in forever myself. That's that's fucking creepy, dude. Hey, Mr. Noodle, welcome, love. Okay. Are we going to the bottom? I guess we are. We're going down. Why are we here, though? <laughs> what are we doing? It was sleepy. Same, dude. Same. So, that person is not us. I'm assuming then we're the person that's, like, all wrapped up there. Or not wrapped up, but, like, in the, the cloak or the blanket or whatever. The one that appears to be dead. I use the Yulakol Doloya. Oh, 
Orazulam Kos Ilzozeriku at Zoko Amnos Kriudu Laomism Wok was you a dealer's also? View ours is in view. Ecola Kizado, you Lola. Is this was I? Oh, Miss Creek. You are a lucky car. Wait, no, that's. Are either one of these people us? <laughs> Maybe we are that person there. Oh. the whole like hour or so that I played of eco this is giving some eco vibes <laughs> but, but I, I really haven't played enough to say that though What's up, man? Welcome. Actually, have control of the camera. Is the Kumaku? It is all of you, Iweriko. It's no ours, Amuso. A little click if the least do is.
Ahora, you do new. That explains why we're running around trying to kill these things. I never did understand that. To get the soul of our sister, lover, friend, whatever back. Yeah, I thought we were, like, a lot older. <laughs> I don't know if that was just a misconception by me or if something's, like, going to happen in the game here. Triangle jumps, okay. I would like to... Can I, like... Yeah, change the camera options. Is that an option? Options. Uh, horizontal camera control. Inverted. Vertical aim control. I don't know. Might need to change that. Okay, up is down. Down is up. That's good. Left is left. Right is right. That's how I like it. I'm just trying to go next to the horse to get on. But the horse isn't gonna like come down here, right? <laughs> like, I don't, I don't feel like. How is the horse supposed to get down? Can I not get on the horse? Oh no! Don't hit the horse. That was rude. So we're just going, like, straight over here. Where'd the horse go? There's a lot of motion blur here. Where'd he go? Oh. <laughs> He's showing us the way to go. Good job, horse. Because I was lost, that's for sure. Horse goes faster every time you kick. Does he get angry if we kick him too much, though? I'm tempted to just, like, explore. You just threw me in this wide open space here. Are we just standing on the horse? That's pretty sick. I don't like how the, like... Camera is all the way to the side here. Yeah. Oh, okay. We can jump off the horse, too. Good to know. What does circle do? Circle brings that back up. Square, I'm assuming, attacks. No, square also brings that up. Yeah. X yeah. does yeah. that. Yeah. Okay, I don't think we can attack while we're on the horse. That's fair enough. Now, I'm pretty sure it was sending us over here, right? Yeah. It's yeah. where all the sunlight seems to gather. Yeah. 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 Okay. 
Where is does the horse refuse? Okay, I think the horse is refusing to go that direction. I think we're on our own here. Is it possible for us to go in here? I'm climbing would make sense. Can we climb up like vines? Sorry, one to grab. Yeah, there we go. Do we have like a stamina bar? Doesn't seem like it. Oh wait, that red circle started shrinking. Okay, so that probably has something to do with our stamina. Using R1 to grab on, use the left analog stick to climb. The analog to just camera. Yep, get that. We have a nice large jump, thankfully. I don't remember if I replied or not, <laughs> but no, I don't. I don't think you need. Uh, who is that wonderful girl saying to you every time you <laughs> join the stream, you weirdo? Oh. That was weird. Why did the bar, like, start filling up there? Is that... Oh. That's, like, how high we can jump? Is it possible for us to jump that high? Thank you, man. Appreciate that. And Optijack, hello, my guy. What's up, man? Nope. <laughs> I take it back. I don't thank you. <laughs> Son of a bitch, I fell too. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Oh, that was close. What was that? <laughs> Did you see the way we like just backflip there? That was... <laughs> that was wild. I don't think... <laughs> I don't I don't think that was meant to happen. I'm, I almost think that might have been a glitch, but whatever. I'm glad it happened, man. It stopped us from falling probably to our death. Okay. Good grab. All right. At least try and go to jump in the chosen direction. Okay, so I found an old PS4 controller, and I think I might have got it from, like, um... I don't even know where, from, uh, like, a Goodwill or something like that. And the, uh, thumbsticks were a little bit gross on them. So I decided to wash it a little bit just now, like, while the cutscenes were playing, with a bit of, uh, rubbing alcohol. And they're, like, so old that they're deteriorating at this point. So I'm just gonna peel the freaking stuff off of them. And then wipe it off really quick here again. Cause like it's sticking to my thumbs and I don't like it. And I'm just gonna have to buy new like thumbstick covers for them. Ban him before you could. Well, maybe you should ban quicker, my guy. There we go. Okay, that one feels loose now again, at least. Yeah, like the sticky crap was getting on the ball part of it, which is making it like the stick stick a little bit too. The stick stick. be honest you can find the button you don't ban people often that's fair try not to when i can help it you know that's the easiest way to do it just go to the settings like for the dude okay there we go might not be as comfortable not having the thumbstick covers but at least now it's not sticking to my fingers you're blaming me. <laughs> How? I haven't seen you in over a week. It's been like a week and a half. How the hell are you going to blame me? Let 
Wait, we have different weapons? <laughs> oh, we do. We got a bow. Our hands. And then, of course, the sword. The ancient sword or whatever. So L1 fixes the camera on him. Does R1 aim? No, R1 crouches. R2 aim? No. L2? Square. Aha, hold square. Do we have infinite ammo? Okay, I definitely need... Oh, I think we got his attention. I definitely need to invert the uh, aiming controls there. Because I'm not going to be able to do that. No. Uh, screen brightness back. Do you like that better, love? I'm not sure I like that better. I'm not sure I like the like black and yellow. It's not ugly or anything. There we go. That's better. Now, I do know from what I've seen of Shadow of the Colossus, I do know there's like you know, weak spots we have to find on them and stuff. And I'm not sure getting his attention the way we did was the smartest move. Probably would have been better off, like, sneaking up on him. How do we dive roll? Oh, that's how we dive roll. Thank goodness. Uh, can we... Oh, yep. Oh, God. <laughs> We're gonna die. It's fine. Um, is he trying to shake us off? Can we stand here? We can. Ah! Oh. There's a sword by using square while still holding on. What'd it say? So hold square and then hit square again. Ah, oh, that did damage. Not a ton, but it did do some. Okay, we need to get our stamina back. We're dead. <laughs> that went well. That's that's fine. I pretty much expected it to go that way, you know, my first time fighting one of them. Um, maybe don't shoot him with the bow before we even get up on him. Experience. Oh, wait, is it like... Ah, nice, dude. It's got a checkpoint, like, right outside of the fight. Okay. Hold on one to fix the camera, and then... Wait, I'm not trying to attack. I'm trying to hold my sword up. to reveal weak spots. Maybe I need to get closer for that to work? Maybe I'm not in the light enough? Do you have to reveal the weak spots or can you just like find them? It's like I'm pretty sure the back of his leg there was one. Oh. Can we get over here without you noticing us by any chance? Or is that... Uh, he's definitely looking at us. Oh, God. Okay. I don't see any weak spots popping up, game. Oh, God. Nope. Nope. Um... <laughs> How do you dodge that? I can't even see myself. How do you get up? Am I dead? Oh, God. I'm gonna be. Hold up thy sword to reflect light under the Colossus. It's vital shall be revealed. Yeah, we tried that. I don't see any weak spots popping up, though, game. Oh, God. I, th I think we were doing it right the first time, though, by hopping up 
on the back of his leg here. Is this meant to be a weak spot, what it's showing here? Nice. I don't know if we can attack the same spot multiple times. Does that count as a weak spot? I guess it must. I mean, it did damage to him. Can we get any higher? Ooh. It must feel like an annoying flea to him, you know? You're a bastard. Stab it! Can I do it again? Okay, now he's down. Haha! Climb, climb quickly. Isn't there like a platform or something that we can get on here? There we go. Jump up. Or not jump up, but yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Are we safe here for a moment? Is there another weak spot around here somewhere? <laughs> I don't appreciate what you're doing to me, sir. Now, if I get like up here, can I... Oh, the top of his head, of course. Oh, God. Okay. That wasn't very nice. He really doesn't want me stabbing his head. Oh, my God. Okay. We're gonna... We're gonna end up falling off. Oh, my God. I'm, I'm about to lose stamina. Okay. Hold on. Oh. We got some back. There we go, dude. There's one. Uh. Damn, every time he like shakes himself, it stops us from stabbing. I think I need to just not worry about trying to get a full stab on him and just accept that it's not going to happen most of the time. Nice. Thank God we're like bull riding champions or something, dude. Otherwise, we'd be in a real tough spot right about now. Jeez, I really don't want to be here on your ear either, my dude, if you'd stop shaking so damn much. Oh, my God. Bro needs to chill. No stab! No! Just stab! <laughs> Jesus, just let me stab you, you dick! Oh, oh god. That was close. There, stab. Is that it? I mean, it was the first Colossus. I shouldn't get too excited. I'm sure they get a lot more complicated than that.
I'll be honest though, I can't help but feel like a little bad, you know. Oh. Oh. I was going to say what we just did didn't feel right, you know? But maybe the black tendrils are about to teach us that lesson then. <laughs> Uh, yeah, sure. I'll save. Why not? One defeated, 20 minutes? I mean, that seems pretty decent to me for first time ever playing the game. I don't know. Oh, we spawn back here. Guessing one of the things are about to fall, one of the statues. Yep. It's a little over dramatic, don't you think? Size cave, it moves slowly. Raise your courage to defeat it. Is this like some kind of demon that's been locked away with these things? And we're just slowly releasing it by being dumb and <laughs> destroying all these colossi? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, wait, eight on this one side? Wait, so are there 16 of them? Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Yeah, it looks like it. I thought there would be like eight total or something. Sixteen, that's a fair few. Does our horse follow us everywhere we go? Except for where it refuses to go? That's pretty dope. Good horse. Um... Handy. Okay, so seaside cave, you say, huh? Oh, I don't have my sword out, and that's why I can't hold it up in the air. Which side is the seaside? Uh, behind us. We need to go behind this altar. Really not the biggest fan of the camera while you're on horseback, man. <laughs> like, I'd prefer if the camera was just, like, zoomed out a little bit. 
with us in the middle? Because now if I want to turn to the right, I can't see what's to the right of me at all. Honestly, you just can't see much at all, can you? While on horseback. It's a very narrow field of vision for as quick as we're moving. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, that was close. <laughs> okay. I didn't realize there was just a fucking cliff here. How do we... How do we stop the horse? Uh, I mean, I guess that works. That's not what I was trying to do, but... Okay, so it's down here. Is there a way down that doesn't involve me just, like, jumping to my death? Or does that why he was, like... Telling us to find our courage. Do we just have to... Do we have to just jump down? Yeah, because it looks like that's where we're meant to go. Well, Geronimo! <laughs> oh, God. Are we going to hit the... No, okay. Oh, we're dead, though. <laughs> that didn't work. I thought maybe we could dive into the water. There must be there must be some way to walk down or climb down, maybe. Oop, my bad. I didn't know. I didn't know. Oh man, at least we just like respawn right here. I wonder if there's, a, like, a story reason for why we can't die. I mean, I guess this guy is, like, the controller of souls or whatever they were saying, right? That's the whole reason we brought our love interest here. So maybe he's just not letting us die until we complete the task for him. There you go. Good. Good horse, go. No, go this way. Why won't you walk? There we go. Yes, yes, yes. The altar, I got you. Although, I did just realize that time we actually got, like, a game over. So, I guess we can die. Right? And that was just, like, reloading from last save. That explains why we got the, uh... Thing again. The cutscene. Thank God the horse won't just yeet himself off of the cliff. Like I will. Not sure how to stop him. Did we pull back? Okay, yeah, it seems like each time we pull back, he goes a little bit slower. And then is there a path down somewhere? That goes across. Maybe we have to go down on the other side? Ooh, does this go down? I mean, it's another path across, and I'm pretty sure that cave down there to the right is where we're trying to go. So it's somewhat in the right direction, at least. It's better than just yeeting ourselves off the cliff. This horse gets scared really easily, doesn't it? Come on, just go down. The meeting option? <laughs> I'm guessing that was autocorrect from yeeting. I tried the yeeting option already, and sadly it didn't <laughs> it didn't go so well for us. We kinda ended up dead. 
I too was hoping we could just yeet ourselves off a cliff and have it all work out. The way the, like, all of the sound just randomly cut, that was weird. Not all of it, but all of the background noise. Okay, now where's this cave? Oh my god. This is where we're going, I'm pretty sure. Oh. Oh, hi. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Once you're dead, so I mean, <laughs> you're not wrong. <laughs> oh. Well, hi there. You look nice. Like, does the beam of light show us where the weak point is? I'm guessing it's on his head again, based off of what I can see here. Can we... Oh, that didn't work. Oh, wait, the bottom of his feet. Lift your foot. Aha! Wait, did he fall? Like, actually fall? He did. Can I get up on him? Like this? No, it doesn't seem like it. Maybe like the other one, we just need to repeat it a couple of times? So something specific happens? Does it need to be the same foot though, or like different feet? Yeah, lift your foot again. Oh, you dick. Can we just like shoot the same foot while he's down? No, that doesn't seem to bother him. Ooh, ooh, from his knee. There we go. Maybe jump up. Oh God, that was a terrible jump up. What are you doing? <laughs> Jesus, dude. There we go. You're making it much harder to move around with the way you're con constantly uh moving, you know? Okay. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Is your weak spot up here? Oh no, that's not what I wanted. Not wrong and not okay is my current status. <laughs> I feel it, man. What's going on, bud? Ha ha! Stab him in the head! Oh shit, I forgot. I forgot how to stab things in the head. One charge and step. Let's go. Stop shaking, you dick. You recharge a little bit.
charge and stab. Surely not all of them are just gonna end up being like stab him on the head, right? I'm pretty sure this is just like an introduction mechanic thing. Charge and stab. No, don't let go, don't let go. Not while you shake him like that. We do need to recharge some stamina, but. Okay. Grab. Wait, did his point of weakness just go away? Oh, okay, yeah. So how do we... Does he have a new one now? You're back? Welcome back. And he used to scare the hell out of you as a kid? I've never played it. That I can remember, at least. I know I played a little bit of Eco, the predecessor. Not much, but... Did we? Well, yeah, you guys did at least. So I don't think I ever played it. Not that I can remember. Oh, no, grab on, dude. Okay, maybe... Maybe we just took too long and we just need to, like, re-shine our light on him? Maybe the weak points aren't weak unless we... Oh, that was too close. No, that didn't seem to work. So maybe we do. Maybe we have to go back down and just like restart. You could fight the first Colossus. Okay. Yeah, I don't remember the demo disc to be honest, man. Uh, please don't fall. Where am I? I'm like on his leg. Thank God the dude's got like mushrooms growing off of him here. We already killed the first Colossus. Brothers in Arm games and Jack Racing. Jack Racing's fun. Brothers in Arms isn't bad either from what I remember, but... Oh, that was a bigger drop than I thought. That's I was gonna say that's gonna hurt. Get up. <laughs> okay. Oh wait, there's a weak point on his ass. Oh, I didn't need to come down here. I bet you we could hop off of our horse and grab onto his leg if we were, you know, good gamers. Just remember there were dead cows you could hide behind in the Brother Arms game? Nice. Stick it in his ass. I'm trying. Stick a sword right in his ass. Come on, lift your foot again, you dick. Aw. No, for somebody that's supposed to be like super slow, you sure do move quick. I guess when you're that large, even like slow steps or, you know, a hundred of our steps. I say, it seems like the front ones would be easier to hit. Okay, lift your foot again. Do it. Do it. Damn you. Oh, now you lift your foot nice and high for me, huh? Damn you. Man, the frame rate is absolute garbage. <laughs> I really think if we do end up playing through the whole game, we might end up playing the PS3, PS4, whatever it was, remaster of it. Because, whoo. Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's literally what I was just saying. Yep. Holy shit, dude. It's pretty and all. It's very brown, but other than that, it's really pretty. But holy shit, does this frame rate suck?
Wait, where's his ass mark at? Wait, grab holy balls. Uh, do I need to jump up from here? Oh, yeah. Oh. Maybe it's back on his head. Maybe it like shifts between the two. Jump, grab. Jump, grab. Okay, now jump up. Oh my god. Okay, hold on. Would it be better for us to just climb around it, like down and then back up? <laughs> Assassins. Thank god all these beasts are furries, dude. It may have more than one vital point. I figured that out. Bro, we're gonna die. Jump. Oh god, we didn't jump. We really need to recover stamina. I really just need to get over this, please. Oh, you bastard. Okay. This is where I wanted to be. <laughs> the way we fucking get thrown around, dude. No, why? Just go over the fucking ledge, dude. I'm trying to jump over it for fuck's sake. Like I'm on the ledge, I press triangle. Now go over it. There you go. Thank fuck, my guy. Now, is this weak point reactivated? No, it's not. So then where the hell was the other one? I remember seeing it on his ass. When we were, like, down bottom there. Do we need to re-shine our sword? I don't even know if that works, like, why we're on him. Bro, I'm, like, the size of a flea right now compared to you. Why are you freaking out so much? Bro, I can't see shit. Uh, nope, that's the wrong direction. Haha! <laughs> Thank you for throwing me up where I wanted to go. I know it may have more than one vital point. I'm trying to find the other one, you dick. I thought it was here. Oh shit, there it is! <laughs> okay. Oh my god. That was close. Oh no, okay. I'm trying to go up. There we go, thank fuck. Okay, grab his ass. Now stick that stick in his ass. <laughs> no, you dick. Stick the stick in his ass. <laughs> now quickly, before he shakes us too much. Do it again, do it again dead. Get fucked. All we had to do was find that G-spot, you know? Took care of him real fucking quick, dude. Can we run away from these black tendril things? No. <laughs> no, we can't. So are they, like, corrupting our soul? Sucking the soul out of, out of us to give to her? There's, there's something going on here, man. Killing these creatures cannot be good for anybody. Besides maybe that Demio dude or whatever the hell his name was.
just looking at the case. Oh shit, I have to cart slow one. Yeah. Yes. Introduction. Crouching regains health faster, that's cool. A bird! Anger of the sleeping giant shatters the earth? That doesn't sound good. Okay. I don't know why. I thought her character was like a middle-aged dude, not... Not this. We look way too young. <laughs> Here to save her, just fucking stab her instead. Can we, like... What happens if we, like... Oh, no, that instantly pulls out our sword again. Can we do anything, like, with our hands here? I wonder what the point of our hands are. We can't seem to, like, attack or do anything with them. Yeah, pressing the attack button just instantly brings out our sword again. Interesting. Okay, so the next one he said... Some do with the sky, so I'm assuming it's some sort of bird. Okay, so it's over this way? Higher or lower? Really? So it's close to where we just were with the, the, let's call it a turtle. It's not a turtle, but <laughs> the giant one in the cave by the sea. The giant one, yeah. Like, like they're not all fucking giants. Jesus. Love that our horse just follows us around. I feel almost like the game's too bright, dude. Also, are my settings like... Is that right? It's, oh, shit. It's been a little while since I played a PS2 game. What else is below that? Yeah, I'm on the right profile. Yeah. Uh ah. -huh. Yeah, so like right here somewhere. But I'm assuming across the way again. Excuse me. There we go. Yeah. Do we go across the same land bridge again?
my god, dude, it's so fucking bright. Like, <laughs> Jesus, can't see shit. There were definitely some, uh, interesting choices made with the lighting and shit. Instead of going down, I'm guessing we just go up this way. I like the random splash of super green there. We do have a map, right? That's what this is? Yeah. Sadly, it doesn't actually tell us where we're going, though. What is... Oh, that's where the last Colossus was. Okay. Ah, it's broken up into grid squares. That's handy if we ever had to, like, look anything up, or maybe it's possible to find hints or something. This looks like death. <laughs> I don't know what it is about this this canyon here, but this looks like we're going somewhere bad. This light purple haze thing going on isn't helping anything right now. Is that a fucking spaceship? Okay, it looks like... I'm guessing no light can get in here because of this haze. Can we swim over to that? Oh, shit. I didn't mean to call the horse. The horse can come out a lot farther than I expected. Can we... Swim faster by any chance? Well, no, we can dive though. I don't know if it's actually faster, but it feels faster. So our stamina bar also like doubles as our breath bar. That's handy. Guess it makes sense to reuse like that one thing for everything. I'm assuming up here is where we want to go. It made a point of pointing this out to us, so. God, I really hope I don't fuck up this jump up here. Okay, it's just right there. It's not that far. Shit, fuck. Okay, no, we're fine. <laughs> Eating ourselves off there ain't too bad. It's, it's not like the fucking the side of the mountain when we eat ourselves off that. That wasn't too bad. Do we jump farther if we hold triangle? Because we weren't even close. What happens if we run out of breath? Do we just like instantly die or? Is it like most games where your health bar just slowly starts to decrease? Tempted to try it, but I also don't want to have to come all the way back over here right now. Okay. Holding triangle does not seem to make us jump farther. 
as soon as we press it, we seem to just jump. Maybe we just need to make sure we get a running start. It doesn't look that far. Okay. We good. Now, I think we're probably trying to get over to here, right? Can we jump? But won't let me jump away from it where I'm trying to jump. And I can't seem to grab onto that. <laughs> Shit, fuck again. Ah. Uh. <laughs> It finally started to jump, like, away from the wall like I was trying to do, and I done fucked it up. Game could really stand to have, like, a sprint button, though. I would love that. Rue, what's up, my guy? Packing some shit and setting up your laptop that you didn't even realize what time it was? Yeah, dude, it's probably, what, like, 11 o'clock for you? It's got to be getting pretty late. But packing some shit, are you moving? Almost midnight? Damn. Damn. Oh, yeah, that's right. You're only two hours, not three. I always think three for some reason. Good, I'm tired. Oh, fuck me. My face is all red. Ugh, I don't know if it's like my fever coming back or. Okay. Now, can we please not fuck this up? I'm pressing away from the wall. Away from the wall. There we go. Grab it, grab it. Oh, thank God. Now up. No, jump up. Okay. Oh my God, dude. Jumping up things is the hardest part of this damn game, I swear. Once you graduate, you and your friend plan to move into his grandma's house. Oh, well. Sorry to hear that she's in a nursing home. That sucks, but <laughs> I'm glad you, uh, find, hopefully, found somewhere to go. Friend co-worker took it to copy the disc and transfer it to your game PC for you from your old PC. That's a nice of them. She keeps breaking her damn hip. Oh, no. <laughs> oh. I swear to God. Okay. Are we up? We're up. Oh, thank God. Oh. I guess it's alive. Yeah, I guess. It's just... Maybe it's just the nursing homes from, like, where I'm at. But all the nursing homes around here fucking suck, dude. At least the ones that I've had family in. You're not what I thought you were going to be. I thought this thing was going to be like a bird. This is like some type of giant soldier or warrior or something. Did we run up your giant meat cleaver foot thing after you attack us? You are going to attack us, right? I, mean, I guess we might be able to climb up his legs. I can't see anything. Can we climb up it? Ow. Get up. Get up and run. 
Don't call the horse. I don't think the horse can get here anyways. Okay, yeah, no. I don't think we can climb up its legs. Get up, please. God, we are slow. Yes, perfect. Attack us. That's what I wanted. Can we climb up this thing somewhere? Oh! Oh! -ho! <laughs> okay. And this looks like fur. Fur's always good. Now they remade this game, but what's the point of fighting these things, anyways? So, okay, in the beginning of the game, we are with a woman, a presumed love, presumed love interest of some sort, and she's, like, dying of some sort of curse, apparently. So we bring her to this altar and put her down, and some godly entity uh, speaks to us, and we ask it if it can free her soul or whatever. Because apparently that's what he does. Or can't, like, he can control souls. Anyways, and he says that he can, but only if we kill all of these colossi for him. That's, that's pretty much all we know right now. Okay, well there's one of your weak points at least on your head. The real question is, how do we get up to your head? Get up, get up, get up. Oh my god, we're so slow. I mean, it makes sense. We're just like a dude, right? Can you try and stab me again, please? I would appreciate it. As far as I can tell, that's the only way up to you. Oh no! Son of a bitch. I didn't realize we were, like, at the edge. Can we jump up from, like, here? No. Damn. Oh, that was... Oh, thank God it wasn't, like, an actual drop. Oh, if we had fallen down all the way, I would have been pissed. Oh, wait, there's just a ramp here? Boy, that's so much easier than the way we got up here. Alright, sword bro. Stab me up, fam. Do you have any other weak points? Like, maybe one we could shoot? I wish this was... character-based, not camera-based. Are oh, you stabbing? Stabby, stabby, stab. Uh. Uh, no, get up! You fuck! Jesus Christ, we're so awkward. Try that again. Stab me again, please. Shine in your eyes. Armor where it seems brittle. That mean we can shoot it to get up it? Okay, we are way too close to the edge again. You should read the plot. It's wacko. I believe it. It doesn't seem brittle enough that our arrows do shit. Can we just shoot it in the eye? It's just Zelda now. Hi! <laughs> Jesus Christ. Dick. I got up there once. Uh, Noodle, thank you for the five bits, love.
There we go. There we go. Just run up it. That's what I like. Oh my god. <laughs> and instantly just fall off. Perfect. Surprised if you fall asleep on the couch. When don't you fall asleep on the couch, love? Are we running too far away? Is he just that slow? Okay, we're grabbed. Just, just, just keep holding. The armor wear seems brittle. Yeah, I get that. So do we hit it though, or do we like shoot it? Yeah, well, that didn't seem to do anything. Do I need to jump over to there? Oh, that was scurry. Okay. I'm gonna get motion sick. <laughs> You're moving. <laughs> oh god. You're moving way too much. Calm down, bro. I'm just trying to murder you, I promise. Oh my god. Jump up. Jump up again. No, not sideways. Up, dude. Oh my god. No. Definitely no VR. Jump! <laughs> oh god, okay. Alright, we're somewhere. I don't know if this is the right answer. But, but this is something. Stop moving so much. I'm trying to get up you. Oh my god, okay. Um. We're gonna run out of fucking grab strength, dude. I can't. I literally can't do anything. Okay. Up. I think we just gotta wait for him to stop moving. Honestly, it's a miracle that we can hold on even this much. Yeah, you keep saying that, but my arrows don't do anything, and I can't hit him with a sword. I mean, maybe I could hit his feet with a sword? I don't know. Are you going to stop moving anytime soon? Can we jump up now, please? Why can't I jump from here, man? Smack him in the feet doesn't do anything. Maybe it's just the glowy bits. Maybe I need to hit like those specifically. Which isn't too easy when he moves around this much. No? Uh, excuse me. That didn't look nice. You're trying to crush me. I admit. I don't know what to do with this one. I mean, I'm pretty sure I need to get up to there, but... And based off the hints that weird voice keeps giving us, I think we need to break his armor somehow. I don't see any way to do that. Magic light doesn't give us any hints, right? Yeah, 
yet. It only really seems to... Well... Oh, he has one on his midsection, too. That's good to know. If we can get to his midsection. The armor it wears seems brittle. I get that. Maybe we can shoot his midsection. I don't know, like, if shooting their weak spot with the arrow works, or if it only, like, only the sword really affects it. I have no idea how that works. Of course, I can't even see the weak spot on his stomach now, so... I mean, I think we were doing the right thing before trying to climb him. We really need him to do, like, the stabby attack again, though. I think that would be... No. Yes. I didn't dodge quick enough. Oh, wait. I did. I did. Get up. No, grab, please, you dick. Yeah, it seems like the weak point goes away as soon as we... Wait, did he just kill us? Oh! Wait, did some of his armor just break? That happened because he hit the... The stone plate here? Was that the trick all along? Ow. His armor definitely does seem to be breaking. I can't see anything. This is... I think we need to get him away from it so that he'll hit it again. Pretty impressive how a tiny little man boy fights a giant rock, yeah? Again, though, there's something like majestic about these things, man. It feels wrong to be killing them, but feel like we don't really have any choice either. Okay, so now if we just sit here, he'll try to hit us again, right? Err, so angry. Did that knock off more of his armor? I'm not sure that actually did anything. Other than hurt us. So that time he technically hit like behind it, huh? Do the stabby attack. Maybe that'll knock some off. Like the straight down. Oh no, wait, that broke a path all the way up his arm. Yes, let's go. Okay, so now, yeah, we just need to get up him now. I can quickly. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. No, 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 no. Grab, please grab. Oh, thank. Thank fuck. I wonder if it would have been possible to get up him the way that we were trying to before, though. <gasps> Holy shit. <laughs> okay. Run up the sword, run up the sword. Trust me, I, I have a couple of times. It just wasn't possible to get anywhere as far as I could tell until now. Because we didn't know how to 
break his armor until it just kind of happened by chance. Okay, I need to, like, get up. Yeah, they're not actually made of stone. They're just wearing, like, stone armor almost. All of them so far at least have had hair that we can... <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, fuck. Bless me. Anyways, I've had some hair that we can, like, grab onto. And then we stab him in the head. Oh, fuck. That was a weak-ass stab. Stab him again. Come on. It's gonna go away if we don't keep stabbing him. <laughs> just keep stabbing. Just keep stabbing. <laughs> And those eyes are creepy, right? Uh, are we even on the head at this point? No. We're just holding on to, like, his ear. And stab. Oh, wait. Did it go away? It went away! Okay. <laughs> Don't mind me. <laughs> Whoop. <laughs> just going down your body here a little bit. Oh, buddy. That was scary. Grab his chest. Grab. Grab. Thank you. All right. And stab. Come on. Pull back your sword. There you go. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. Stop moving so much. Stab. Let's go. Oh my god. Stop moving. Okay. Stab. One more. One more, one more, one more. Let's go, dude. Three down. Only like 13 to go. Yeah, and then, like, these tendril thingies come off and fucking <laughs> do that to us every time we kill one. So that's fun. <laughs> Don't know what that's about. But it can't be a good thing. <laughs> right? <laughs> it, it looks like a bad thing, that's for sure. Oh, fuck. I'm really enjoying this game, not gonna lie. It's jank as fuck. A lot of it is jank, man. The camera controls, not great. The way you get flung around, not great. I mean, it's understandable, but not great. <laughs> like how hard it is to stab things and whatnot. Um, just grabbing things in general, kind of jank. But God, is it fucking fun to finally like climb one of those things and just stab it to death, <laughs> like. <laughs> That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Yeah, it's definitely going on the list of games to complete. Um, but if I can find my PS3, 4, whatever it was copy, that's probably the copy we're going to play. Just for the uh, not so much... I don't even really care about like the graphical enhancements. Just for the smoother frame rate. Presumably smoother frame rate. Rose of Guiding Graves, that's not, you know. Giant indeed, but fearful it is not. Chocobo, what's up, my guy? Hmm. Fuck. I'm sorry to do this, like, right after you join Chocobo, but I think that's going to be it for, for us tonight. If you can't tell by how red I currently am, I'm still sick. Um, <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> I'm ready for just to go to sleep. Look at your character if you can. 
What do you mean? He doesn't look any different that I can tell. Although, again, I did... Doesn't look like you can see it yet. Oh, okay. Yeah, I did always think that the main character of Shadow of the Colossus looked different. To be honest, when we were first coming in here, I thought maybe we were the person all wrapped up in the cloak or whatever. But no, that ended up being her. So this is obviously us. But, yeah, no. So, I always thought we were, like, older or something, but... Anyways, it's fine. Have you ever... Have you... No. I don't think I've ever even played it <laughs> until tonight. <laughs> I have the, uh, like, the remaster collection for PS3 or PS4, whatever it was. And I played a little bit of Eco, right? <laughs> but I never played Shadow of the Colossus. I... What the fuck? I know. It's insane. PS2 classic, but I've never... I've never actually played it. I, uh... I remember seeing a lot about it on G4 back in the day, right? And I've seen some, like, YouTube videos, and I think I watched a speed run, possibly, at some point of it being done. But, um, I've never personally played through it. I know nothing about the story other than I think you said that it's, like, connected to Eco in some way, right? Pretty sure you could beat it in two or three streams. Yeah, I kind of figured, just based off of the fact that in the past... We've only been playing for an hour and a half, and that includes, like, the beginning cutscene and whatnot. And we've killed three of the Colossus. And there's, what, 16 total? So we could presumably do another one in the next half hour. So that'd be four every two hours. So that'd be about four streams at that rate, but maybe some would be quicker than others or whatever. And, like, it's hard to say, but... Ugh. No, it's really good. Be MGS2 in six hours? I did not. <laughs> I don't think. How long did it take us? It probably took us, what, 12 hours? <laughs> probably. Maybe nine. Nine to 12 hours, I'm guessing, somewhere around there. Uh, Metal Gear Solid 2. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, but anyways, yeah, no, it's definitely going on the list of games to complete, though. Um, even though it's jank as hell, it's a ton of fun taking down these massive beasts. And while it's really been, like, story light, it really knows how to hook you, right? Like, with all of the mystery. So I'm very curious about what the hell's going on in the game. Um, but I do think I'm going to try and find my PS3, 4, whatever it was, copy we'll play it on that maybe we'll wait until eco comes first but you'd recommend this first so like story wise eco is before this one but in your opinion play this one then that one is that what you're saying eco was made first right pretty sure it was sorry i'm, I'm just curious how long it actually took us to beat metal gear solid 2 now Metal Gear Solid 2. Uh, five. Um, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Yeah, it took us about 14, 15 hours <laughs> to be Metal Gear Solid 2. A lot longer than your, uh, your six that you said. Both story and release, and yes. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I mean, I'm fine with doing it in whatever order. Um, are they directly connected? Eco and... Shadow of the Colossus? Or is it just like same world sort of thing? I thought... I didn't think they were directly connected. But I know like nothing about it. Although... Even though I only played like the first couple of hours of Eco, if that... Um, I was getting some major Eco vibes whenever they like rode in here together on the horse and everything. 
You did 100% dog tags too, yeah. I... Nope. <laughs> hey, did you end up picking up the uh, collection? I saw that it came out. I'm, uh... Thematically, according to Google? Just thematically, okay. Eco takes place... Oh, you misspoke. Eco takes place after this. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. So this isn't the two little kids from Eco then. What was I saying? Oh. Oh, that's how you played MGS2. Okay. So you mean just like recently you played through it in six hours. Gotcha. I thought, yeah. <laughs> I thought you meant like previously. How is it though? That's what I'm, that's what I was really curious about. I've heard pretty good things. Okay. Correction. I've seen headlines that have said pretty good things about it, but I haven't actually like watched any reviews or anything about the remaster yet. Um, I didn't even realize that it had come out until I saw it on um, Nintendo Switch. I saw the uh, the collection at work, and I was like, oh shit, that must be out now. And then I got an ad for it on Steam, which is where I'll probably end up picking it up. Especially because I have the other games on Steam already. Um, I think the only one I'm missing is, what, 4? Metal Gear. Yeah, Revengeance, 5 Ground Zeroes, and 5 The Phantom Pain. So all together, the only one I'm missing is 4. And if I bought the collection, then that'd be 1, 2, and 3 all on PC. And then I would just... I don't even know. Is Metal Gear Solid 4 on PC? I know 4 is not in the collection, sadly. It'd be nice if I could just finish it all in one go. Metal Gear Solid 4. Actually, I guess it'd be IV. No, it doesn't look like it. That's lame. Yeah, it's got the Master Collection. 3, 2... lame that's the only mainline game i'm missing though i have one and two on the nintendo even though two i don't think is canonical in any way um and then i own one on the playstation classic thing i don't have a physical copy although i'd love to get one and then i own two and three and then i have five on pc so yeah the only one i'm missing is four four is effectively a movie with some gameplay isn't that more or less all of them, though? Let's be honest with each other. Like, <laughs> aren't they all effectively a movie with some gameplay? Really freaking good movies with some uh, pretty good gameplay at that. But <laughs> somebody needs to just throw money at Kojima and uh, let him make a movie. Because that's what he wants to do with his life. Anyways. Yeah. I am going to get off. I think that's pretty much it for me tonight. Um, I'm I hurt. I'm tired. My face is red. I'm hot. <laughs> I'm gonna take a nap. Well, not take a nap, but lay down and probably go to bed. Maybe play a little bit of Pokemon in bed. Um, I still plan on streaming tomorrow. I'm feeling a bit better than I was a couple of days ago. I don't have as much of a headache. Um, I'm just tired from a mix of being sick and being back at work just has me worn out that's that's most of it at this point occasional cough or sneeze and a little bit of pain in my chest but nothing nothing too bad so i should be able to stream tomorrow night uh baldur's gate with my brother mr optijack here been having a ton of fun with that we're trying to make our way through it so we can eventually get to two or three and uh yeah hopefully Next week will be a normal schedule. Although, with that said, there is one thing um, that I wanted to ask while everybody's here, or while some people are here. Tuesdays are the day that John and I are going to be doing the podcast once a month. We plan on doing one October 31st uh, on Halloween um, at starting around, you know, midnight, around the time I normally stream, midnight, 1230, whatever. Um for the return of the podcast it's going to be a whole new format so the first one will probably suck while we work on figuring things out 
but since Tuesday is also our um, one stream a week of the Elder Scrolls, should we switch Tuesday and another day for for the normal game nights? Have like Elder Scrolls on say Sunday night, and then just do like a random PS2 game on Tuesdays. That means roughly three weeks out of the month, you know, everything is going to be the same, but it would just be that one time. You're down for that? Okay. That's what I was thinking, just so that way we don't miss... That way we can still stream Elder Scrolls once a week um, without missing any. Because otherwise, there would be a two-week period without any Elder Scrolls. Whereas if we do the PS2 on Tuesdays, then three out of the four weeks every month, we would play PS random PS2 games twice a week and then once we would do it once a week so i figure yeah that's fine nobody cares fine yeah <laughs> that's pretty much what i figured i didn't think anybody would really care um but yeah especially since well chocobo you work anyways so <laughs> both those days i'm pretty sure so uh yeah i didn't figure you would really care and yeah so but all right cool that's probably what we'll do. So Sunday, we'll probably be streaming Elder Scrolls. And then Tuesday, as long as everything goes to plan, I will be uh, doing the podcast with uh, Mr. John and maybe OptiJack, but probably not. He's always welcome to join, um, but because of his work schedule and whatnot, probably not. It's kind of what me and him have discussed before. But uh, anyways, yeah. You're off Tuesday, but you'll be honest, you have little interest in Morwen. Nah. Okay, <laughs> that's fair. <laughs> I get it. I, I didn't honestly know you were off on Tuesdays, but um, yeah, that's fair. It's not for everyone, I feel like. <laughs> Just because I think the story's good, but mechanically, the game is very... Uh, different than the other Elder Scrolls games that's sure for sure about time you've been worried about doors he's doing well he's doing well he had some stuff going on there for a while um and then whatnot but yeah very brown and very slow this is true I feel like most games of that type are pretty slow though to be honest like Skyrim let's be honest has a lot of downtime in between the action moments um I haven't played Starfield but Fallout, I feel like, is a little bit better on that front, but Fallout as well can be very slow a lot of times. What day? Tuesday night. The last Tuesday of every month um, is the plan. So for this next one, it would be October 31st, if you want to join Mr. Optijack, sir. Um, the one thing we haven't discussed yet, because, yeah, there's a new format... Like I mentioned, we're each going to be playing something indie um, and something uh, else. I don't remember. <laughs> I have to look at the list. Um, and then we're going to be doing like a section that's just like classic, just one more level style thing, you know, where we both play the same game and we talk about it or whatever. Um, and then we're gonna have a section where we just talk about whatever the hell we want, whether it be, like, a movie we watched recently, a game, probably mostly games, but whatever. Um, and then we might talk a little bit of news, like, gaming-related news and stuff like that in there somewhere as well. And, uh, yeah. Could have killed a fourth Colossus by now, that's true. I've been trying to get off, but between vacation and then instantly getting sick after, I just haven't had a chance to talk to people, to you guys, about this stuff, so. You since Skyrim fighting a wolf doesn't take three minutes? It depends on your difficulty. Have you ever played a legendary mage, like, or on legendary with a mage? It can take a long time to kill a wolf. <laughs> but it's not down to RNG, right? It's, it's down to skill and uh, your equipment and level and stuff like that, which is, I feel, better than just dice rolls. That's the one thing I don't like about Morrowind, is the dice rolls for everything. But anyways. <sighs> okay. Too much talking. I'm running out of breath here. Legendary unhanded? Fuck that, dude. Nope. <laughs> I played a legendary mage for a handful of, uh, sec a handful of sessions, and it was terrible. Terrible, man. It takes so long to do anything. I'm just like, it's possible, mostly with cheese, 
But it takes fucking forever to kill even basic enemies. I think I got through like the first dungeon where you get the little tablet right there in the beginning that you then take to the keep. I can't remember the name of anything. Is it Winterhold? No, I can't remember. But anyways, um, I got like through that dungeon with my legendary mage and I was like, this is fucked. <laughs> and then I just, uh, I think I took the difficulty down to like master or, or maybe the next one below that. I can't remember. Shouts carry. Do you, wait, you actually did a legendary unhanded run? That's fucking insane, man. I, I just, I can't do it. It just takes too long. Which dungeon? I can't remember the name of it, but uh, the one with the giant spider at the end for the boss. Um, where the, uh, like when you go to the first town and you talk to the shopkeep and you're getting his thing. I can't remember. It's like the first dungeon that you do in the game, but like I said, my memory's terrible. But yeah, I hate that. Time. Bleak Falls Barrow. There you go. <sighs> the E3 dungeon. Yeah. You didn't full clear, but you did kill Alduin. I mean, that's more than I've ever done. <laughs> I've never, I've never beat the game. <laughs> I've put literally hundreds, probably like 500 hours into Skyrim, and uh, I've never beat Skyrim. <laughs> it's just, oh man, I didn't even beat Fallout 3, which is like another of my top played games until just a few years ago. So when I first uh, finally beat it, and then New Vegas not too long after that, like... You have 3,000? Holy shit, dude. That's a lot. So I have five, maybe 600 hours into Skyrim. And I've only ever played on PC, though. And, uh, yeah, I've never beat Alduin. I've played this game a lot, I can see. <laughs> Once you get there in 2035, hopefully it doesn't take that long for us to get to Skyrim, but uh, we'll see. My my plan is to finish up uh, Fallout 4 right around the time that uh, Elder Scrolls 6 is coming out. You know, that's, that's my plan, <laughs> right? Because we're going to do more when Fallout 3, New Vegas, um, no wait, Fallout 3, Oblivion, New Vegas, Skyrim, Fallout 4, and then by the time we're finishing up Fallout 4, Elder Scrolls 6, man. Let's go. <laughs> it's perfect timing. You'll see. <laughs> Anyways. Anyways, guys. I'm actually legit getting off now. I need, uh, I need a drink and lay down, catch my breath, maybe turn on the air conditioner even though... Like, I'm cold, but I'm not at the same time. I probably ain't going to be able to go straight to sleep, but I'm going to lay down and relax at least, yeah. <laughs> Anyways, though, thank you guys. I do appreciate you all coming out. This game, again, is definitely going on the two complete list. Um, so, yeah, put some votes in for it if you want to see it. But until then, have a good night, everyone. Uh, be kind to each other, and I will see you next time. <laughs> Bye! Once I find my thing here, I'm very slow. I'm apparently blind. Oh, because I'm on the wrong thing. That's why. There we go. Bye. Spread Bring your religion to me. And that's, yeah, you can't. You don't have, have your own religion, man. What do you mean? Mm, I do. It's.